this is a short video to explain um, how to install Zone 2 on an Ekadan FTC 5 cylinder. Um, I've done it myself, it's very easy to do. On your low loss header you've got these. You'll find out that on your standard system you've got a primary pump for the heat pump and you've got a secondary zone uh, which is your main house radiators. You've also got a domestic hot water pump. On this diagram here you can see your main pump. That is wired up into TBO 1 and 2. This is the wiring diagram Mitsubishi should give you. It's wrong. Zone 1, Zone 2 flow, Zone 1, Zone 2 return. Dead easy. Your main house radiator is going Zone 1 and 2 return. Your underfloor heating or second zone goes in Zone 2 and Zone uh, zone 2 flow and Zone 2 return. That is wrong. TBO 1, 5 and 6 does not go to Zone 1. Look at the outs. Yeah. Out 3 on the board, which is 5 and 6. Yeah. Out 3 on the board is not 1 and 2. See what I mean? TBO 156, TBO 4, 1 and 2. Wire zone 1 pump, yep, to out 13, which is there. Yep, and wire zone 2 pump to there. Look at the outs. Forget the TBO, look at the outs. You also, it says to install, as long as you're not having a mixer valve downstairs controlled by the system, to install this junk. You do not need it. That is only if you're putting a mixer valve in. So if you're putting a secondary mixer valve for your um, system, if you're installing an underfloor heating with a, a manifold from eBay or anything like that, it's got its own mixer valve and you just need to run zone 2 floor and zone 2, zone two return, which anybody can do, 22 mil pipe, full bar isolators and that pump, which you can buy a US 3 pump or anything like that, an auto pump, dead easy to set up, you buy a pump for 40 quid, you can do your secondary zone for less than 50 quid. Do not buy the thermistors, it does not work, it does not need them, it doesn't even see them on the board. Um, you flick your, flitch, your, your switches on, which are them. So you flick them on the board, make sure your system's off. Yep, flick them on the board. Installs on two. You've got your zone one installed and you are finished. Turn it back on, set your wireless zones up on your panels. Message me if you need any details on that. That's dead easy to do. Setting a zone one up, setting a zone two up. Most expensive thing is buying your wireless controllers. It's absolutely easy. The system will look after itself. It'll have a right word with itself for one day. Floor temperatures will be all over and then it'll be absolutely perfect. It's warmed my underfloor eating up and it's cost half as much as it did yesterday and it's warmed the whole house up. Just a short video just to say Mitsubishi are not always perfect. I have just run technical today at half past nine this morning, today on the 24th of September 2019, and he has confirmed that is wrong. Yep. Zone two, zone two floor. Yep. And zone one floor are back to front. So use the outs. Look at your zone. Look at your outs. Forget what it says TBO. The 3 and the 13 are the wrong way around. Do not use the misters and fire the system back up and you will have in a zone 2. Thanks.